Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me the new Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 Lite and in this video I will show you top 10 tips and tricks about Samsung Notes. So guys, let's start. First of all, we will open the Samsung Notes. Okay guys, and now you can see here the first thing that I want to show you is about categorization. So you can see here I create different folders over here according to my subjects. So you can do the same. Simply what you have to do, you have to see this option over here. It says manage folders. You have to click on this manage folder using your S Pen. Okay, and then uh, when you open the managing folder option, the very last option over here is about add folder. So I click this add folder. Okay, and then here you can give it the name of your subject. For example, you want to give it a name of uh, let's say geography. Okay, and then you can select any color from here. For example, I select this green color. Okay, and then I press done. Okay, so you can see over here now the folder has been created and the other thing that you uh, can do is you can also create subfolder. So when once you click on this uh, geography folder, so a small menu will open and then you see the very first option over here, it says add subfolder. So inside folder you can create as many folder as you want. So for example, I create a subfolder and I give it a name of uh, uh, geography one okay and I give it this color and then I press done okay so you can see over here I created a folder and then I created a subfolder now I want to uh, make a notes in this folder so I will go back from here okay okay and then if I want to create a note simply I click on this one Okay, and then you see this plus uh, sign over here. This is for creating a new node. Okay, so I press this plus button and now the node has been created in front of me and now I can start working on my node. Okay guys, so this is the first tip. The second tip is about converting your handwriting into text. So in Samsung notes, you can convert your handwriting. For example, I write here. Okay. So you can convert anything into the text. So simply what you have to do, whatever you write over here, after writing it, you have to uh, press uh, this uh, icon. You can see over here, it's written here T. And when you bring your pen closer to it, it says convert to text. Okay. So simply I press this. Okay, and now you can see it already converted my handwriting into, into the text. Okay, and then I press this convert option. Okay, and then guys, you can see over here, my handwriting has been converted into text, which is really, really helpful. Now, if you want to edit it simply, okay, you can press over here and then simply you can edit it. If you want to delete something, if you want to put uh, anything over here, you can also add okay you can also change the size of it okay and you can also put number so you, you can do everything because the keyboard is in uh, front of you so guys this is the uh, second tip okay the third tip is about multitasking option so how you can do multitasking using your samsung notes so on the right side over here you see there is a small tray over here you can see over here there is a small tray you can just bring it over here like this okay and then you have all the options available over here if you want to open a new window so for example i want to open the internet so simply i just drag it like this okay and then i can drop it over here here uh, on the up or on the downside so i just drop it here on the side okay so now you can see i have my notes over here and in the meantime i also can search anything on google for example i want to search some image okay and i write here anything for example i write here heart anatomy or heart diagram okay and then you can see over here uh, my all searches are over here and then i can also write it over here if i have any text if i have um, you know, for example any article for example from here from wikipedia or from anywhere i can put my uh, text uh, i can copy it and i can paste it over here okay guys so this is really really useful <clears throat> the other thing if you want to put uh, this image 
into your notes you can also do it simply use your s pen uh, just tap on the image okay and then simply just drag it like this okay and then you can leave it over here and then you can change the size of it like that you can change the position as well so this is really really helpful this multitasking option you can also copy the text and you can also paste it over here by just using your s pen and bringing over here so this is really really cool feature so guys the fifth tip is about pdf you can edit your pdf you can annotate your pdf in samsung notes so what you have to do you have to go back okay and then you see on the top right corner over here it says import pdf you can see there is a very small icon over here and when i bring my pen closer to it it says import pdf so i will just click on this okay and then you can uh, bring your pdf file wherever it is located for example it is located in my uh, internal storage okay and then for example i select one pdf file and then i press done so it will bring your pdf into your samsung notes and from here if you want to add it you can also edit it for example if you want to uh, add something here you can add in your uh, pdf file okay so for example you you want to edit anything you can uh, if you want to remove something you can also uh, remove it okay if you want to uh, remove the image you can also remove it okay and if you want to uh, put image over here you can also put the image okay you can uh, do all the functions in the pdf file which is really really uh, helpful okay guys so uh, the other thing that i want to show you uh, is about uh, shapes so in samsung notes you can create different shapes and these shapes um, you can create it uh, professionally so i will show you how so you simply have to use uh, this icon over here it says neat shapes okay so i just click on it and then for example i create a circle like this and then it will make it in a perfect round shape i can also do like this okay okay so you can see there are different uh, shapes i can create you can see over here so uh, you can create these shapes you can also link them as well okay you can also link them so this is really really helpful guys so if uh, you want to um, uh, if you want to uh, edit these shapes you can also edit it for example i click on this like that and then if i want to change it i can also change its size i can also change the angle you can see over here so there are a lot of things you can do with these shapes so this is really really helpful the other thing uh, that i want to show you is about uh, templates so for example you want to create uh, different templates so you have to go here in these three dots over here just click on here and then you see there is a page template option so just click on it and then it gives you multiple page templates for example you want to use this uh, template with a line okay so you can use this uh, template okay and then you can also write it over here okay so multiple template options okay guys and then um, if uh, you want to uh, save it uh, save this file it, the samsung notes is giving you the option to save it as a pdf as a powerpoint as a word okay i will show you so you can see over here the very first option over here it says save as file so when you click it it gives you the option so you can save it as samsung notes file you can save it as pdf word powerpoint image or text file so this is really really helpful guys <clears throat> to save your work as whichever format you like the other thing is uh, the uh, duplicate option for example i create this note okay guys so the note is over here right so if i want to duplicate this note i can also duplicate it i just click with my pen like this okay and it is selected now and then on the downside you see there is an option it says more okay and then you can see the second option over here it says duplicate note so i just click on it okay and you can see the note has been duplicated so two uh, notes has been created so you can create multiple copies of one note if you like and the last tip that i want to show you is about backup or uh, about sync option so simply uh, you have to go over here in the settings okay so the very first option it says sync uh, with samsung cloud so you have to turn it on in order to sync your files 
okay and then and once you click over here you can see samsung notes it's syncing now so you can use the option of syncing using wi-fi only or wi-fi or mobile data so it has multiple option put your email id and then it starts syncing your uh, samsung notes so guys this is really really helpful and uh, the samsung notes is giving a lot of options so i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video so please do subscribe to my channel guys thank you very much